Welcome to the first video of our long weekend to Cancun. We stayed at Coral Level at Ibero Star Selection Cancun. Upon landing in Cancun, we were met with a long immigration line, so we were happy to get outside to our shuttle and have our favorite Caribe cocktails. It's only a quick 20 minute ride from the airport to the resort. If you're not familiar with this resort, it's sort of a resort within a resort. There's a family side and an adult side. The adult side is Coral Level. Regardless of which side you're staying on, your shuttle is going to drop you off at Abiro Star Selection Cancun. If you're staying at Coral Level, you and your luggage will then be shuttled via golf cart over to the Coral side so you can get checked in at their lobby. You're going to be greeted with a cool towel to freshen up with and a non-alcoholic welcome drink. While you step on that, you can take in the gorgeous turquoise views that you are now blessed with. At check-in, you are going to be given a wristband that's going to signify that you are staying coral level, and it's also going to double as your room key. We are so glad to have you with us here today and hope these vlogs are helpful to you. Welcome to sunny Cancun. Spend the next three nights with us here at Coral Level at Abiro Star Cancun. First drinks here, going frozen mojito with Malibu. He made it so cute with a little raspberry and strawberry. Ordered up some food at the snack bar. Got a burger, um, pork quesadilla, nachos, french fries. You want a cheers cup? Hola. Cheers. Cheers. Oh, it's good. Started off with some steak nachos, and then Kev's coming with a burger and quesadilla. Look at this view. What do you think about your burger, your favorite the burger? Was burger. Really good. I mean, that was, that was Have you favorite. ever had a bad burger, Kev? I mean, I, I've had so many I can't remember. I'm not like a, I don't do my burger reviews, but I should have started them. But it was it was a good burger. It was um, actually all the food there was good for the, for the chef. It's a, like a lunch shack, so yeah, all the food was very good. The fries were very good. They had a nice uh, chipotle mayo I love, and uh, how was your quesadilla? I had pulled pork quesadilla, excellent French fries, nachos with steak. Honestly, I'm I'm impressed with the food so far. Drinks are good. I'm happy as a clam. We're just waiting on a second round of drinks. I think we're gonna hop in the pool and just live our best life.
with this resort. It's kind of a resort within a resort. So we're staying at Coral Level, which is the adult side of the Abero Star Selection Cancun, which is the family side. If you are looking for a fully adult only resort, this may not be for you because there's only one dinner restaurant. So if you don't want to eat at the same place every night, you'd have to go next door. Um, same with the gym is next door, coffee shop is next door, and most entertainment is next door. But um, we're really loving it so far. Let's see. Cool. We got one like nine. One, yeah. Is it on? Yeah, there we go. Nine, one, seven. Kept playing darts. I got a Coco Loco double Malibu. It's very good. <laughs> and a water. Got a hydrate. Unique to the scene. We gotta let the music play. Kevin, 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 one, two, three. That was the point. That was the point. I want to show you what I'm going to do. Chance, Kevin, Kevin, Kevin. Ah, Kevin. Cuidadito, Kevin. Tercera y última. Ay, 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 Kevin. Third last one. all have in-room Bluetooth speakers so you just pair it with the button on the wall and they go over it when the bellboy takes you to your room it was super super easy to use and there's speakers throughout the room and the bathroom Good evening, everyone. Brittany's still getting ready, so I'm just gonna head down, take the elevator. We are on the 10th floor. Um, head down to the lobby bar here at the adults only um, resort and get a drink and wait for her. She's getting ready, curling her hair, and uh, we're straightening it. I'm not sure which one. Uh, she has both with her, both uh, tools, so we'll see.
So I just texted Brittany, I said he wanted to come out and listen to the musician. But then I was thinking she was doing her hair all night, so it's a little windy. I don't know if you could tell. Because the palm trees, people with their hair. what I bought haul then you would already like know this but I bought um, pants from like Chloe pants from TJ Maxx or Marshalls um, just a white tee um, my jewelry is from Sheen um, Kev is already down at the lobby bar he probably already checked in with y'all it is 6.30, I'm not 100% sure where we're gonna go for dinner. So the only restaurant here, there's only one restaurant, and I believe tonight it's a barbecue buffet outside, which I'm not a, I'm not really an anything fan. I don't really love barbecue, I don't love buffets, and I don't really love eating outside. It's very windy right now. So I think we're gonna like double check what's going on, but I have a feeling we're gonna go over to the family side. Kev just texted me and he said there's a guitar player outside which I can now hear something. So I'm going to um, pack my purse and run out the door, go meet Kev, get a drink. I'm gonna put the green on so they can come in and do turn down service. And that's gonna show out here. Club pineapple. Yep. She brought us a little uh, peanuts. We have these in the room. They're like lime and salted. They're super, super good. It's like 7.15. We're gonna have to go to dinner soon. I don't know how long the wait's gonna be. Kev's drink looks pretty. It looks like, uh, it looks like, like sea glass from, from Turks, Turks and Caicos. Caicos. Yeah. yeah. We're on the same page, Kev. For dinner tonight, we did go to the Italian restaurant on the family side. We got right in, we had no wait. From the coral side, it's a super short walk over here. You can either walk through the convention center, which is all covered, or you can walk outside through the resort and walk by the pools and you'll get right over there. We started out with some bread and they gave you oil and vinegar. For appetizers, we started with a Frito Misto and that was fried fish and veggies and calamari. And then we also had fried mozzarella. For entrees, I was undecided between sea bass or salmon and ultimately the waiter said go for the salmon. So that was very good. Kev had chicken parmesan and then we split spaghetti carbonara. We didn't get any desserts over here because we wanted to go and find the coffee shop. What you're looking at right now is the lobby bar on the family side and they had some nice live music and entertainment going over here.
my quits. It's 8.30. I actually commented at dinner that like I was surprised that I was feeling so like raring to go and then eight o'clock hit and we both were like, we like hit a wall. We kind of got like a mini turn down. So they did our blinds and our like bed sheets, that's it. We didn't get any like waters laid out. But speaking of water, I don't know if I mentioned it earlier, there's no bottles of water here. They're very echo friendly. So they have large bottles of water and then when you're at a pool, you get a reusable um, like hard plastic bottle, I guess it would be. Um, so I guess it makes sense that they wouldn't be putting water by the bed, but we're gonna see it tomorrow. We pre-booked a cabana tomorrow, so we're really excited to just have a really fun day. So thanks so much for watching. If you have any questions, please leave them down in the comments, and we're gonna see you really soon for day two. Thanks for watching, bye. today. I don't even know I liked Ed Sharon, but with the double mojito Malibus, I love Ed Sharon. I don't really know what else I have to say.